Mobile TV Group got started in 1994 here in Denver, Colorado, and we started out just doing Denver Nuggets games. Nearly 20 years later, we're up to about 26 trucks and we provide uh, facilities uh, literally all over the United States. Whenever we build a new truck, we get the latest camera and the best camera we can find. So right now at Grass, it's an elite front end and a 3G back, but there is a new camera coming from Grass Valley this spring. We'll consider that. What makes the LDX new and different in many ways is the CMOS chip. But from what I see so far, it is a very smart move by Grass Valley. Look, Grass Valley has been a solid, uh, provider of facilities uh, to the mobile industry for many years. It's got to be everybody's first or second choice. Grass Valley has some outstanding product people. The head of manufacturing for cameras, the product managers for the switcher, the, the router. Really good people, great technicians, and I really enjoy my relationship with them. The one piece of equipment that you pretty much have to have for high-end sports production is the Cayenne switcher today. The vast majority of our trucks are capable of doing dual feed, but that means we can do the home show in the main production area, we can do the visitor show in a secondary production area. When the Cayenne came along, we were very pleased because it was even more suited uh, to the dual feed. Uh, with the Cayenne, you can have two separate productions, two different control panels with one electronics, one set of inputs and outputs, serving both shows. We're in the business of producing images and sound. They have to look as good or better than anybody else's. The router is such an integral part uh, of the infrastructure of a truck. With each new truck, we tend to get larger routers because the demands uh, keep increasing. More cameras, more sources, more outputs. Uh, and the Trinix has been great that way. And it's large and we need larger. As we look towards the future, we're going to be going uh, in two slightly new directions. One is what we call our home feed production is going to expand uh, so we can do even bigger production. At the same time, we see a need for more feeds. So not only a home and a visitor, but perhaps pre and post games, perhaps international or, or clean feed to the leagues, and also Spanish language feeds. Uh, and so we have to build a truck or perhaps a pair of trucks that can do all of these things at the same time and still keep the costs uh, under control.